last week uh, yung train law na pinasa years ago ng Kongreso, ito yung Tax Reform for Acceleration and Inclusion Act of 2017 or train law ay pinagtibay ng ating Korte Suprema. In other words, isang N-Bank decision ang pinalabas ng ating Korte Suprema at sinabing konstitusyonal itong train law na ito. Ito ay uh, kunisyon ng ACT Teachers Group at uh, pati yung mga consumers group. Sabi nila unconstitutional because nung uh, pinasaan ng House of Representatives ito ay eh, walang quorum. And uh, sabi nila ito ay isang tax which is prohibited and regressive kasi especially yung excise taxes kaya napakataas ng uh, prices natin sa diesel, sa coal, sa liquefied petroleum gas and kerosene dahil dito sa train law. Hindi lang yung mga yan, in almost all transactions uh, ini-impose itong train law. Sabi din ng mga petitioners dito, anti-poor at lalong pinapahirap ang sambayan ng Pilipino. And uh, the Supreme Court in its decision said, hindi naman tama na sabihin yung walang quorum because nagkaroon ng bicameral conference committee between the House of Representatives and the Senate and yung committee report ng bicameral committee dinala sa House of Representatives and kinonfirm nila yung report. In other words, ito sabi ng Korte Suprema, kahit walang quorum nung pinasa nung araw na yon, na-confirm naman, na-cure yung defect nung yung kinonfirm ng House of Representatives yung bicameral conference report. At uh, ang sabi naman sa tungkol sa, sa sinasabing anti-poor na masyadong prohibitive, masyadong uh, regressive, Itong tax na ito, eh, ang sabi ng Supreme Court, hindi naman fix yan. Itong train law, eh, inoorderan lang ang Kongreso na gumawa ng a progressive system of taxation. So, merong mga rates at ina-adjust yung mga rates from time to time depende sa need ng ating Bureau of Internal Revenue at ng gobyerno. So on this note, uh, uh, sabi ng Korte Suprema, hindi rin na-approve na yung sinasabi niyong anti-poor eh, general statement at hypothetical lang. No? Walang, uh, na, walang data na naibigay yung petitioners, walang proof na anti-poor, hindi sila nag-present ng ebidensya na maraming naghirap dahil sa train law.